Hello everyone, your girl Samantha Gomez here. Today I'm going to show you how I install some beautiful Marley slash Havana twists and my lovely friend Sarita. Hey, what up? is my model so she actually did this with her sister but it's kind of getting old and stale at the top so i'm going to show you guys how i attach it also show you two different techniques because i believe that a lot of people do tutorials but they don't kind of go close to the scalp so you can see it so i'm going to try my best to show you how I braid in the hair I'm not and also I'm going to show you how I just do like a twist in. So without further ado, let me get started. So as you can see with this one, it is completely coming out of the scalp. So I'm just going to take it out real quick. So I just took out her old twist and I'm going to be using two strands of the Marley hair to achieve this style. First I'm going to take a comb and detangle her hair. And now I'm going to take a little bit of the black Eco Styler Gel and apply it to her hair. So now that her hair has been detangled. I'm going to take the Marley hair and wrap it around her hair. Now I have the two strands of the Marley hair in my left hand and her hair in my right hand. I'm now going to fold over the two strands of the Marley hair to make an X and use the third strand, which was her hair, to start braiding. I simply braid usually about five to six times. There you can see the braid. And now I'm going to twist. As you can see, her twists aren't very large. So in order to achieve the style, what you need to do is you need to twist your fingers as I'm doing and then twist. Twist your fingers and then twist. This ensures that the twist is tight versus more like Havana twists where they're a little bit looser. I'm gonna show you just one more time. Her hair becomes the third strand in my braid I braid about half an inch and then I twist for the rest of the way. So here's the second method. What I'm going to do is take her hair, split it in two pieces and place the Marley hair right in between. I'm then going to take my finger, place it in the middle to secure it, and I'm only twisting one side. A lot of people teach that you need to twist both, but I'm just going to be twisting the side in my left hand backwards. Once I'm done that, I'm going to take the side that I twisted and twist over the other side. And then I'm just going to continue twisting all the way down. As you can see, this method is a lot more natural looking. You can't really tell that we are using extensions in order to achieve this style. Now I didn't go all the way down just because we're not going to be using this method, but I just wanted to move it and show you how natural it looks. I'm all done. So these are her twists. As you can see, they look fresh and brand new all over again. I just redid a couple of rows and she looks gorgeous. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hopefully it was helpful and I'll see you on my next one. Bye.